We can't enjoy the daytime when we neglect a good night's sleep. But sleep disorders are on the increase thanks to the modern lifestyle. And women are 50% more likely to suffer from insomnia than men of the same age group. So what exactly is insomnia? Insomnia is defined by difficulty falling asleep, difficulty staying asleep, or waking in the early morning more than three times per week for at least three months. There's much more to insomnia than being tired and clumsy during the day. Research is showing us a whole area of side effects linked to low quality sleep. Sleep is essential for maintaining immune health. It restores energy levels, it improves memory and cognition, it regulates the mood, it provides time for every cell in your body to regenerate, it helps decide when certain hormones are released and specific body functions take place. Asking for a pharmaceutical solution should never be an early step. Sleeping pills are highly addictive and are hardly a cure. In fact, one of the top side effects of prescription sleep medication is daytime sleepiness. The first steps to a good night's sleep have no side effects whatsoever. These are lifestyle changes. And changing your lifestyle often means changing your diet. That's what this short video is all about. We're going to take a look at three of the best and the worst foods for insomnia. We'll see why these foods particularly affect how well or how badly we sleep. But before we begin, please click the like button. We depend upon your interaction and use your feedback to help us improve every aspect of our channel. Perhaps you would like to subscribe and keep yourself up to date with all the latest women's health information. And please carry on watching to find out how you can claim a free gift. Let's start with that list. Interestingly, when you eat these foods doesn't matter. They improve or reduce sleep quality whenever you eat them. We'll get the bad news over with first. Coming up are the three worst foods you can eat if you have trouble sleeping. Are any of these part of your daily diet? Cutting them out will significantly improve the quality of your sleep. Worst food number three, butter. If you want to enjoy a deep sleep, cut down on your butter intake. Butter is concentrated, saturated fat. While fatty meats are also not recommended, they're not such concentrated forms. Butter definitely is. The higher the percentage of energy produced by saturated fats, the less slow wave sleep we have, the longer it takes to fall asleep, and the more often we wake in the night. Reducing saturated fat intake and replacing those calories with protein and fiber has positive effects in as little as three days. Worst food number two, soda. The more soda you drink, the less you sleep. And this effect isn't only found in caffeinated sodas and energy drinks. Even diet sodas without caffeine negatively affect sleeping patterns. That's because sugar and sugar replacements from sucrose or stevia make the brain produce dopamine. Dopamine has a stimulatory effect. It makes us hungry for sugar, slows digestion, increases urination, raises the body temperature, speeds up the heart rate and causes anxiety. We now know dopamine release is a response to sweetness in any form, not just sugar. Soda or diet soda should never be a part of your diet if you want good, reparative and rejuvenating sleep. Worst food number one, processed bakery products. The worst sleep reducing food you can eat at any time of the day is not a single item, but an entire group. That group is processed bakery products, bread, Pastries, cakes, biscuits, and even crackers have a few things in common. A high glycemic index score, they often contain high levels of saturated fat, added sugar or sweeteners, and they significantly and negatively affect how well we sleep. A recent study reported that postmenopausal women suffer from insomnia when they eat a high glycemic index diet. Actually, many studies show this effect. Scientists think the key reason is insulin. Insulin is released when we eat carbohydrates. The more quickly a carbohydrate is absorbed, the quicker the insulin surge. Insulin affects how the body uses a group of large neutral amino acids, or LNAAs. One very important LNAA is tryptophan. Tryptophan is an ingredient of serotonin, the feel-good hormone. Serotonin doesn't just make us feel good, it makes us feel sleepy. 
A high carbohydrate meal late at night makes us feel sleepy. This used to mean researchers thought a high GI meal before bed improved sleep quality, but this idea has changed. Although a high GI snack might help you fall asleep more quickly, you won't stay asleep, especially if you are insulin resistant. It's no coincidence that we suffer from more sleep problems as we age, because the older we become, the more insulin resistant we become. And when our cells are insulin resistant, sugar stays in the blood for longer periods and we produce even more insulin. Insulin surges trigger the release of chemicals like adrenaline and cortisol, and these wake us up. Those were the three worst foods to eat when you want a good, healthy, regenerating night's sleep. We'll find out about the three best foods in just a minute, after we've given you the opportunity to claim your free gift. Our free gift to you is all about the power of nutrition. Simply click on the secure link below to get your copy of 25 Energy Boosting Superfoods for Women. This book is packed with dietary information that energizes your waking hours and makes getting a restful night's sleep so much easier. Because as we're going to see right now, some foods have incredible superpowers. We'll start our sleepy countdown not with sheep, but with fish. Best food number three, oily fish. You don't have to picture them jumping over fences. Just add a few portions to your weekly menu. Oily fish are an excellent source of omega-3 fatty acids. Modern diets provide too much of its close relative, omega-6. But without the correct omega-3 to omega-6 ratio, we lose sleep. To even out this ratio, reduce fried food intake and increase oily fish consumption. Eat fish like salmon, pilchards, anchovies, mackerel, and sardines. Studies show that diets deficient in omega-3 lead to disturbed sleep patterns. When we don't get enough of it, our internal clock doesn't function well and the sleep hormone melatonin isn't produced at the right times. Best food number two, cherries. Cherries are a tasty way to banish insomnia. They also work against cardiovascular disease thanks to their effect on the vagus nerve. The vagus nerve works to relax the body. It's this effect that links insomnia to heart disease. When the vagus nerve is stimulated, we are less anxious. The heart rate slows and blood pressure dips. Digestion improves and fewer stimulating chemicals are released. In this relaxed state, the body is better equipped to sleep. Cherries also contain high levels of sleep-inducing melatonin and serotonin. It's best to eat a handful of raw cherries than to drink a glass of cherry juice. Raw cherries contain lots of fiber. Fiber is an important part of the number one best food for insomnia. Best food number one, live yogurt with bran fiber. Although full fat animal milk yogurt contains saturated fat, this isn't enough to disturb your sleep. Animal and vegetable based yogurts encourage deep sleep because they contain healthy bacteria, vitamin D and tryptophan. The gut plays a huge role in how well we sleep. By consuming healthy bacteria, we encourage the gut to work for us, not against us. Vitamin D deficiency is heavily linked to insomnia. So the extra boost, especially during the winter months, is important. Finally, the amino acid known as tryptophan has long been associated with deep sleep. There's enough in a single serving of live yogurt to make a difference. But why add bran fiber? Fiber is a prebiotic. Our gut can't absorb it, but our all-important gut bacteria can. When you add a tablespoon of bran fiber to live yogurt, you're feeding your gut bacteria. Fiber consumption has been proven to produce a deeper and longer period of sleep. It's no coincidence the modern, low-fiber diet is linked to every type of sleep disorder. We hope you've learned something new from our list of sleep-inducing and sleep-disrupting foods. Please don't forget to like us, subscribe to us, and claim your free 25 Energy Boosting Superfoods for Women book. See you again soon.